Hi everybody, this is Tom from the Tool Development Team and today I'm going to start a small series about points because points in Tool are super powerful and my favorite topic and I think they need more dedication. So what's a point? Um, if we click this here, um, we have this operator called a point and it generates a, a point structure on the CPU and we see that it has the parameters x, y, z, so a position it has this w parameter and an orientation which is x, y, z and w. So it's not Euler but it's quaternion and most of the time you don't want to mess with these numbers directly. So altogether that's eight, um, eight numbers and it is not a coincidence because this is super fast on GPU um, and we try to achieve most with only these eight uh, values. So um, if we feed this to a list to buffer operator, it generates a buffer on the GPU. And if we look at this uh, visualization here, so we target this, we can just target it up there. We see here's our point, it has this um, W there in the middle and the orientation here. So what can we do with this point? So to start with, you can draw meshes at points. This is uh, uh, probably the simplest thing, draw mesh at points. And uh, let's combine these two. And maybe we should also actually uh, load a mesh. So um, let's pin this. So there's our mesh here. Oh, it's huge. Um, so of course, uh, why would we ever do this? Um, so to start with, um, let's pin this here. So you can use uh, the gizmo here to move this mesh around. And of course, you can have multiple meshes. So if I select this here, so we can see that we now have multiple meshes. And this is, of course, CPU instancing, so it's ultra fast. So you can, of course, have uh, many, many, many more meshes. So um, if you pipe this in here, so we see, okay, we have many meshes. Of course, we can do things like uh, randomizing these meshes. And uh, if you randomize these points, we see right now we are not randomizing, but if we change the position, we can already do some really crazy things here. An interesting notion is like this randomize W. So W right now is being used for the size. So used W for size. So there are all kinds of different ways this can be used. Um, but uh, yeah, size is normally the standard thing. It can also be selection and it depends on the operator you are using, how W is being used. So um, yeah, there you have it. This is already super powerful. So obviously you can play with all these uh, and maybe one day I will do another tip of the day about like each of like these point generator uh, operators. But uh, I want to keep this short uh, and I will continue tomorrow with some more topics on points. See you then. Bye.